Welcome to week number one for Kate. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is our six week course where our slimmers are going to lose a stone. Hi, Kate. Hi. I've just been saying, where are all those kids gone? I know, I've bribed them with TV and healthy snacks. <laughs> oh, that's just what I like to hear. Yeah. <laughs> right, have you been on the scales? I have, yeah. And what's the news? The news is I've lost two pounds. Yay! I'm really pleased with because I've also been away for the weekend. So that is perfect, it, isn't it? To have lost anything, to be honest. Yeah. Where did you go? Anywhere nice? Uh, well, yeah, it was. It was lovely. It was Yorkshire. Yeah, we went up to Yorkshire. Yes. All right, go down there. Okay, didn't last very long, did it? The snacks have run out, Kate. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Shush, shush, shush. Because he is, he's helping mummy, so shush. shush. Right, Sorry. Let's have a little, it's okay, don't worry. Let's have a little look through your food diary then. Um, so this morning we've had a little bit of fruit loaf with some uh, spreadable, some Norpex. Yeah, that, that was my mum's fault. <laughs> She's feeding you. She's feeding me, that was meant to be for the children, but then she was like, oh, should we have a bit? And I was like, oh, yeah, I have a bit of peckish. So, yeah, that was my mum's fault. <laughs> right, I will be catching up with her later, so yeah. I will address this issue <laughs> yeah. to make sure it doesn't happen again. Um, for lunch today, <laughs> you've had a salad with a peri peri chicken. Yeah. And again, lots of good uh, pumpkin seeds, some pine nuts, some yeah. sunflower seeds, so that's great. Uh, yesterday was when you were away still wasn't it so you've had some pancakes for breakfast yeah this is a bank holiday breakfast it's okay I know. I know. you've also had some uh rice krispies yeah and then for lunch was uh chicken cheese a bit of brie so it, yeah it was a bit weird we basically had lots of leftovers to eat so we stuck them all in a picnic basket and took them out with us so it was uh, it was all a bit random but that is what we had <laughs> i was trying to read all those ingredients and trying to yeah. figure out what the meal was and then there's it two make a meal. in there as well <laughs> yeah it didn't make a meal at all <laughs> we like one of those little snack meals uh, yeah. and then in the evening was a little bit of uh, chicken and fries yeah, Which it was really naughty, really know, naughty. The good news is uh, you stuck with your calories yesterday, didn't you? I did, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I did, but it was a miracle. <laughs> you see, you're perfect. Six calories remaining. Yeah. And th this is what it's all about, especially with your kids and stuff. You know, I want you to be able to enjoy yeah. your, your journey. Yes, that's um, yeah, and and it's that's why the tracking's really helped actually, because I've sort of been able to see where things that I thought were healthy or thought were good perhaps weren't. Yeah, and and like you say, I've actually been able to factor in a few treats and, and to still have lost two pounds despite having had sort of ice creams and things like that has been I'm really pleased with. So, yeah, it's been really good. Right, Saturday morning was a lovely breakfast where you had sausage, bacon, eggs, a little bit of toast, uh, and also some mushrooms. Yeah. In the evening was uh, pizza. Oh, did you make your own pizza, it looks like? We did, yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. We did, we made our own pizza. Fabulous. And then also, again, a little bit of snacks, lentil curls, a bit of ice cream, and some cola. Fab? Yeah. Um, and then you burnt 708 calories. What were you doing on Saturday? We went on a great big long walk. Perfect. A really long walk, carrying nine kilos of baby with me. <laughs> <laughs> and this is where you burnt all those calories. That's fair. Yeah, yeah. So we, yeah, we went on, um, yeah, about eight, eight or nine kilometers, I think we did. Um, yeah, so it was good. Well done. Uh, Friday was a um, just I think it was a bread cob was it with a bit of butter I can't remember what I had on Friday now off the top of my head there's just bread and honest. butter uh, in Is there that all I put on? just bread and butter 
Yeah. <laughs> that all I had all day. <laughs> I'm guessing you ran out of stuff. <laughs> I can't remember no. what we did have on Friday. Oh, this is Friday morning. And then for lunch was a salad yeah. with some chicken and again, pine nuts and pumpkin. And then in the evening was mince. Oh, it's a oh, spaghetti bolognese. bolognese. Yeah. Great. Um, and then again, you squeeze into your snacks, a couple of rich tea biscuits and one of those mini lemon loaf cakes. Oh, very good. I'm not meant to say that, am I? They're terrible. No, you are. They're you amazing. can. It was it the quick. My question is: Was it worth 300 calories? It really was. Yeah. Was it? I actually, I it was. I made it as well. I made it worth 300 calories. I made myself a really nice. I drink black coffee, so it's quite quite good for for slimming. But I made myself yeah. a lovely coffee, and I turned the TV off, and I sat, and I and I really enjoyed every single mouthful of it. So yeah, it was. It was. It was worth it. But I'm, I'm not doing it all the time. It was worth it as a one off. <laughs> But this is what treats should be about. You know, it should be really mindful. You should plan it with a nice drink, sit down. Yeah. Great. Yeah, it was lovely. All the kids were in bed. It's great. Oh, were they? <laughs> Even better. <laughs> <laughs> right. On Thursday morning, you had one of the protein shakes. How was that? I really like that. It was, it was actually a random one that my friend had given me to try because I've, I've never been a big fan of them and I wasn't sure whether I'd like it, but I actually really enjoyed it. Um, I hadn't got skimmed milk, so I had to make it with um, with whole milk. So it would actually be even better normally. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I did. I enjoyed it. It's definitely a good, quick, easy, easy breakfast because I'm I'm rubbish at breakfast. I don't. Yeah. I never either have time or the inclination to eat at that time in the morning. I have to really force myself. So. Yeah. Obviously, it was good. food is food is always better, but. Cost wise, you know, time wise, family wise, yeah. life wise, you know, if it needs to be a protein shake, then I do actually recommend them because they they get the job done. That's the, the yeah. key. Yeah, well, that was it. And I stayed full for ages. I was full for, you know, yeah. a good sort of three or four hours. So that was really good. Fab. And then for lunch, you had a salad again with chicken and the pine nuts and the seeds. I know, I'm boring, aren't I? <laughs> no, this is good. When you, Especially things like nuts and seeds, you can't have enough. You know, your body absorbs all the nutrients, which is good. Yeah. And then in the evening, it looks like it was a lovely dinner. Chicken thigh roast dinner, I think, basically. Oh, yeah, it was like a one pot, like a casserole. Yeah. Um, that I found on like the BBC Good Food website that I put in like healthy chicken meals or something. And it came up with that, which was quite good. Lots of veg. Excellent. Um, some chicken thighs. Yeah, so not bad. A Wednesday, you had a banana for breakfast and then sweet potato for lunch. Yeah. Uh, in the evening, it looks like it was another roast dinner. Was that the? Was it the same pot or a different one? No, that it, this one was like a like a chicken pie. Um, oh yes, just with pastry. pastry on the top. Yeah. Great. And a raspberry and mascarpone roulade. Wow. Yeah, nice? we had my in-laws around for tea. I did tea for for my in-laws, so. They like a bit of pudding, so um, but I had a smaller piece than I would normally have, and I didn't have any extra cream on it. <laughs> Great. And again, we we squeeze in some some extra snacks in there as well. Um, some of those uh, sugar free butterscotch sweets, which are the yeah. copycats of the Werther's originals, aren't they? Yeah, they are. And they taste pretty similar, to be honest. Don't yeah, they? yeah, they're very, they're really satisfying. Um, I like them for when I'm in the car because I tend to get a bit snacky when I'm in the car. Yeah. But one of those takes me a little while, and and obviously is sugar free and whatever. Okay. So. Uh, and then a couple of biscuits and a crunchy as well. Again, you stayed within your calories. And then the last day is last Tuesday. You had a Weetabix in the morning with a banana and a pear. Uh, yeah. For lunch was a ham sandwich, and then in the evening was a steak with some rice and vegetables. Yeah, it was um, like a beef stroganoff that, I, that we, I made. 
you make it sound better than I make it sound like shouting out <laughs> random ingredients. And then for your uh, in the snacks with some lentil curls and a crunchy as well. So amazing. Yeah. Well done. Thank you. <laughs> I'd so probably only... lose more if I stopped eating crunches, but... No, it's fine. I really, you know, like I said last week, it is all about the 80-20 rule. And, and yeah. I just want you to enjoy your, the meals and food with your kids. But obviously, if we can just watch the, the calorie amount, then we're going to lose some weight. So that's good. Yeah. Right. What is your goal for this coming week? Are you planning on doing anything different with meals or exercise? Yeah, I, well, I definitely want to try and keep up some of the exercise. So I discovered while I was on holiday, it's the first time I've ridden a bike in 20 years and I actually oh, really it? enjoyed it. So I want to try and um, do a little bit more of the on of riding my bike. Um, yeah. And also, yeah, just trying to get my steps in again because I, I really enjoyed that. Um, and I'd like to lose a bit more this time. I think going away on holiday, we did eat you know i wouldn't normally eat ice creams and things like that so yeah. i'd like i'd like to aim for sort of three pounds this week instead of two um and i'm going to try not to eat as many crunchies okay don't <laughs> <If> <laughs> and i'll speak with your mom and make sure no fruit loaves come your way okay yeah yeah because i do rather love that fruit loaf so uh, yeah I, I have to ban it out of my house <laughs> right any questions um no, I don't think so. I, I was going to ask you about the, the shakes, about the protein shakes and whether they were sort of OK. But yeah, as a, I'm, I'm not sort of looking to use them regularly, but a couple of times a week is something just to I get a bit of something in me. Yeah, early it's, doors. it's good just to have them in if you need to take it away with you or if you come in absolutely ravenous and you want something like now, now, then I would use them for that that type of thing. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. Great. Well, thank you very much, Kate. Thank you. <laughs> I'll let you get back to your lovely children. Thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. Right. Speak to you next week. Speak to you next week. Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. <laughs>